to respect the structures of the party. Like uh, we gave him all the support and respect, he should do the same. And uh, either personally himself or his, or his hirelings, he should stop. Otherwise, as a party, we will uh, not hesitate, you know, to invoke uh, the necessary, you know, statute and uh, take disciplinary action, which should not be very good for him. And at this point now, I want to invite the Secretary General to give a uh, chronology of what happened, step by step, and uh, possibly share the documents. I think uh, the ones that we have uh, filed with the registrar. Uh, this morning, after we presented our papers, we were the first to file the returns with the registrar, and you know she acknowledged that all the documents were proper, uh, but when we left our, our, our colleagues also, um, I think uh, came with their own uh, uh, papers, which I think uh, I'm sure I'm sure they will not go anywhere because the neck we had here was properly constituted in accordance with the law, and we followed strictly the uh, party constitution. So let me welcome uh, the Secretary General to explain more and give a step by step uh, uh, what happened. Do you want me to sit here? Yeah, yeah, yeah boss. <laughs> <laughs> Let's switch, it's okay. <laughs> Come and sit here, David. Thank you for allowing me to sit on the bosses. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm not the it's boss. A, it's know, a privilege. I'm going to serve with you. It's a privilege. <laughs> it's a privilege uh, that you allow me to, to take your seat and also address the nation through our colleagues from the media. As uh, our party leader has just said, this party has a long history. Perhaps quite a number of you members of the press who are not there or you are too young, you would, unless you go back to your, the archives of your media houses and see what this party has done for this country. Our reason and the next reason the National Executive Council's decision to put Honorable Wafula Wamunyinyi as the interim party leader was because amongst us, he is the oldest person with a long relationship with this party. He knows the ideals of this party. They are ingrained in his DNA. Given that he faced the time when things were very difficult, for new parties to move. He knows the ideals. He lives the ideals. And that's why the NEC decided that he was the most uh, suitable person to be given that position. We have presented our documentation. As Secretary General, I followed all the laws, all the regulations that needed to be followed to be able to file our returns with the registrar, which, by the grace of God, we were able to file this morning. We did not make noise about it.